following your true path in life is fulfilling, but it's not always smooth going, especially if you're in showbiz. Rizal Janak is passionate about acting, and her career has taken her from Durban to LA and then to Cape Town. She still remains true to her Durban roots though, and Zaki caught up with Rizal in her hometown recently, where she's been working on some authentically KZN stories. I'm going to plead insanity. Most people think the entertainment industry is all glitz and glamour, but in fact, it's a whole lot of hard, hard work. Rizal Janik is a fellow actor who's making that hard work look effortless, and it is my pleasure to be spending the day with her to find out about her journey in the industry. So we're gonna go breathing first, okay. create pressure in, and out on a sound stronger than that. The next little building block is resonance. Oh, Sorry to be you. interrupting <laughs> you. Nicole, how important is practice when it comes to the profession of acting? It is absolutely fundamental. Much like a professional athlete, if you don't keep honing your craft, you become unfit for performance. I'm going to leave you guys to wrap up. Okay, cool. <laughs> Let's do some improv. Hey, Sheila, you saw that Poovan's girlfriend. Who's that? Poovan's girlfriend. Check your hearing aid, man. And she, she's only what? She's 15. How you know if you don't know who I'm talking about? Ah, uh -huh, uh, these children these days, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. Oh, I'm Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Bye. Cheers. Rizal, what have been some of your favourite roles to date? Playing Trishka in Wide Eyed, a short film that was nominated for Simon Sabella. She's blind after a tragedy and she has to manoeuvre through the house that's not familiar to her. It was challenging, but it brought a new side of my acting alive and I think that's why I love it so much. Another amazing role was playing Charmaine Chetty in Kings of Mulberry Street. I gotta tell you, it was such an amazing feeling to play a woman of that character. She's everything you want in a woman and everything you want a woman to say. Tiki's my oldest. What's he doing homework? <laughs> How did you go about preparing for the role of a mother? Apart from the physicality, I wasn't prepared. I'm with four nieces constantly. They are like my babies. So I was fully equipped emotionally and maternally. You spent some time overseas. What was this experience like? It was really a culture shock in terms of how everything is so fast-paced in the industry. I shot a feature film called The Beautiful Ones Are All Mad that went to being episodic on YouTube. The storyline is fantastic. I play a psychiatrist that's struggling with mental issues as well. So that was a big challenge for me because I I wasn't at that stage of my life where I was ready to take on those things, but I had to open myself up and be adaptable, and that's what we do as actors. I want to ask you a question. Okay. I want to know if you want to meet a character of mine that I hold very dear to me. Her name is Myrtle, and she will be coming with you for a palm challenge. I would love to meet Myrtle, and I love a good challenge. Yes, let's do it then. Hi, guys. So, right. I, I'm taking over um, Rizal's um, feed, but I also took over her vehicle, and I am not used to driving. Oh my word, there's somebody on my, on my lane. So I, I'm Myrtle. It's very nice to meet you. <laughs> Lovely to meet you. I think your earrings look like the sun. Where are you from, Myrtle? I'm from America, Ohio to be exact. So we are doing a pawn challenge today, Myrtle. Yes, I am very interested in doing the pawn challenge because I think that you'd enjoy it. <laughs> this is where it is, the pawn to con. Hello. Hello. Two pawns, please. Okay. okay, so the challenge is actually who can put the whole thing in their mouth and chew it and swallow, and who's the first one to do it with nothing in their mouth is the winner. Okay. okay. Two, three, one, go. go. Mm. 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 Not very spicy. Ah. No! Ah. No, that was so good! <laughs> you also have another account on Instagram, Food Diaries. I love food. It is just one of my languages of love. I'm having a relationship with my pizza. 
I love the account because it's not pretentious. It's just you eating and being completely you. Shouldn't it be that way? Shouldn't eating be a normal thing? But I do have a place that I can take you. It is one of my favorites in Durban because it's so authentic and rich. These are huge. Must have yeah, you can. Okay. We are roti and chai today, okay. and we've ordered the chicken tikka wrap, mm -hmm. and this is the lamb kebab wrap. We're gonna just go for go it. Room. Yeah, big bite. Big bite, okay. baby. Okay. Mm. This is amazing. This chicken is so succulent. I know my face is messed. I don't care. Do people care at home? No. Rizal, where did your love for the arts come from? My mom is a producer of stage plays, so while growing up. I was there in the motions of it. Did you study drama? I did. I got my degree in drama and performance studies and media and cultural studies, but I was trying my way through law first, and then I realized, you know what? I need to deregister that and get going with the drama. The entertainment industry is not all glitz and glamour. What are the challenges that you've come across? Trying to get out there. I had to work really, really hard and consistently. Success is a bad teacher, and that's what I've learned. Failure teaches you a lot more than success ever would. What have been some of your highlights? I think to date would be the role of Charmaine Chetty in Kings of Mulberry Street. It's such an amazing highlight in my life and I'm very blessed to have it. What advice do you have for aspiring actors out there? Be the hardest worker in the room. Be the first in and the last to leave. Appreciate everyone and everything that you get. But most importantly, just be kind when you're on set and when you're with people. You never know who you may need. Rizal, thank you so much for all the fun and for meeting Myrtle. Thank you for <laughs> having me. Ready? Mm. <laughs> <Forward>. <laughs>